you'll probably notice the lack of enemies for the most part in this video and a lot of the open containers. I had this footage originally recorded, but due to my being an idiot and answering some IMs while in the process of recording, created a audio sync issue that pretty much just destroyed the footage, so I had to delete it and go back and re-record and capture a lot of the conversations again and miss most of the fights. So, yeah, shit happens. The unexpected termination of my previous master. You are the only organic which I may now serve. Of course, master. How may I be of assistance? Condescending explanation. Master, the console governing the droid maintenance area and the airlock is voice printed. Musing. In the last days of his life, the maintenance officer was quite careful about voice protocols bordering on paranoid obsession. Conjecture. I suspect once he realized something was wrong in the facility, he voice locked the droid bay functions. A prudent measure, but in the end, he met the same fate as the rest of the organics. Condescending explanation. Oh, yes, Master. The code is Maintenance Control Voice Print ID R1B5. But unless the maintenance officer speaks the code, it is useless. Answer. Master, you cannot. You are trapped here just as I am. There is nothing to do except patiently wait for whatever the future has in store for us. Of course, Master. How may I be of assistance? Finish the sonic imprint sensor prototype for the mining droids. Everyone knows they need an upgrade. The sensor should allow me to issue voice commands to them rather than manually adjusting their routine each time the mining specifications change. I've been keeping the sensor in the maintenance workshop for the time being. I wanted to test it first by recording and playing back some simple voice commands. Finish my examination of the droids from the Ebonhawk freighter. The T3 unit looked like it had shut itself down. The protocol droid, however, made up for it. It talked my ear off for most of the hour, asking questions about the facility, the personnel, and so on. Still, it wanted to make itself useful, so I put it to work until its master wakes up from the med bay. It seems to have some skills in speaking to droid behavior cores, so... There's been some trouble with some of the mining droids, so I'm signing off. Been speaking to the protocol droid about the Jedi and med bay? I thought they'd all gone away or been killed in the Jedi Civil War. The droid told me that his master is the only Jedi he knows of in all the galaxy that the Jedi had served in the Mandalorian Wars almost 10 years ago. That would have meant that the Jedi served under Revan for a time. That can't be good. Everyone knows that all the Jedi who followed Revan fell to the dark side. Been too busy to enter a log for a while. There's been more and more accidents since that Jedi arrived. The miners are starting to get restless, especially Korda. Korda said the exchange is offering a huge bounty on Jedi Knights and that we can make a fortune if we sell the Jedi to Nar Shaddaa. Security shot down that idea pretty quickly. Cordon and his men are gonna give up that easy. I mentioned the trouble to the Jedi's protocol droid, and he seemed concerned about his master's safety. I told the droid not to worry. The Corda wouldn't... When the dock officer reported the droids repairing the Ebonhawk, I saw the voice print ID on the droid console system. Someone ordered them to repair that freighter. But I can't find a trace of the order anywhere. If anyone tries that again, they won't be able to do it from this terminal unless I let them. 
The voice print should cut any user off from the central functions unless I get the code. The maintenance check on the droids didn't help. If anything, the accidents have increased. Security interrogated me about the droids and they weren't too happy with my answers. I understand it though. These aren't combat models. They shouldn't even know how to attack. I can't help but think, what if somebody staged the initial trouble with the mining droids just to get them all sent to maintenance and then did something to them? I think security's right. Someone's trying to sabotage this facility and they're using the droids to do it. But why? Glad you survived the tunnels. Find anything when you were down there? Found anything? Yeah? Did you blow it up? Yeah, we'll watch your back. Droids can't be trusted. So they are still alive. But the dormitory comm isn't picking up anything. Is there any way to get to them? There may be some emergency route to get to them. Still, maybe we should leave them where they are and try to get to the hangar. If they wanted to sell you to the exchange, we should make a clean getaway while we can. You mean like they did to you? You're pretty forgiving. Voice print? Great. That means he'd have to speak the code. He's dead, right? There's ways to beat voice prints, though. If you can get samples of his voice and the right words, you should be able to fake the voice print code, if you know what it is. You know, I overheard the maintenance officer getting chewed out by the security officer. You might want to check the security office on this level and see if there's any voice samples stored in the logs. And maybe there's samples of the code in the maintenance officer's hollow logs, if you can find a way to record them. Well, that's a start. See if you can find any recordings where the maintenance officer is speaking, and try to piece together the words to unlock the voice print.
So, you're in maintenance. Then maybe you can tell me what's going on with these droids. Sir, I don't know. It's like their behavior cores are undergoing binary decay, but I can't find the source. This shouldn't be happening. Well, that's reassuring. It isn't happening. So the next time we nearly have a breach in the ventilation tunnels, I can just close my eyes and pretend it's my imagination. You better give me some answers. I want to know the damage these droids can do if they start mining us instead of asteroid rock. Sir, these droids aren't combat models. Their mining lasers are weaker and less accurate than blasters. I doubt those droids could even hit one of us. Are you blind? What about the miners in Med Bay? It's sabotage, and it started right after the commander said we weren't going to sell the Jedi to the Exchange. So I want you to find out how these droids are being sabotaged. That'll tell me who's trying to clear a path to get that Jedi off the facility and stop him. In the meantime, make sure the security's armed with all the ion and sonic charges you can find. If those droids start coming after me, I'm going to need more than low-grade mining lasers to take them down. Clear? Yes, sir. Maintenance control out. Idiot.